The idea for this game has been around for a while in the mind of Chris Miller, the uh, producer of Fat Princess, and a lot of the key members from that title are now at Fun Bits Interactive. But once we kind of saw what the hardware was capable of on the Vita, it kind of went to a bing. He had it all laid out. It was like, we can do a control scheme like this, we can do this, we can do that, and it just it, it made such perfect sense. A lot of the questions that we get, people are like, why are you just doing it in black and white? Aren't you afraid that it's going to be lost on a little screen? I'm like, little screen? Have you, have you actually held one of these? And when people hold this hardware in their hands, they're like, oh my god, that screen is gorgeous. So going with a black and white and almost a, a noir style to this, there's so many grayscales to it. And the black and white, it's just so crisp. And it's got this kind of old, nostalgic kind of a feel, yet kind of a contemporary playset and it's 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 the best of kind of all of these neat genres just kind of wrapped into one. Little is this tiny scale